Welcome to the Toolsec tutorials of Autodesk Maya. All right, so Toolsec Namer is a handy assistant for managing names of your objects. It's aimed to facilitate renaming objects which have identical names. Select your objects which may have same names and click on the append to list button for getting a filtered list of objects which have same names. All right. So let's create a brand new polygon cube over here and let's group it and let's duplicate it. And again, for these three, duplicate again and again. Let's select all of them and click on the append to list button for getting a list of objects that has same names. All right. You can see a count of identical names next to its label. You can click on any row or multiple rows of the list widget to select and see them in your scene. So let's see this one, this one, or these two. All right. If you want to take out an object or multiple objects from the list, just click on the extract from list button after selecting a row or multiple rows. So let's extract this one or these two. All right. Or you can extract all objects by clicking on the clear list button. All right. By default, the tool ignores instanced objects because even if you rename them, their names will be exactly the same as they type between each other by instancing. If you want to see them no matter what, Uncheck the Ignore Instances checkbox and click again on the Append to List button. All right, for this example, let's create a brand new polygon cube over here. Let's group it and instance it using Duplicate Special. And again, select all of them and click on the Append to List button. Then you can list them in red font color as an indicator of instancing. All right. Finally, click on the rename auto in list button to quickly rename everything in the list uniquely by prefixing parent name of the object. So let's clear our list. Let's delete these instanced objects and let's get back our scene. Select them and click on the append to list button. And finally, click on the rename auto in list button to rename uniquely by prefixing group name into the object name, as you can see over here. All right. Thanks for watching me. See you in the next video.